Muy buena, ¿qué tal estáis? Caza logro, caza trofeo. Bienvenido de nuevo al canal. Soy el Cephirox y hoy vamos a ver Theons of Vega. Es un, es un World Simulator o un simulador de andar. Simplemente eh, terminando el juego vamos a conseguir. Eh, no importa al final que elija, ¿vale? Hay tres finales. Simplemente llegando al final del juego y pasándonoslo, eligiendo cualquier final, vamos a tener eh, un platino. En este caso, dos platinos. Porque es Star que hable. Se puede conseguir en Play 4 y en Play 5. Si lo queréis conseguir por vuestra cuenta, podréis aproximadamente tardar entre 30 minutos y una hora. Si lo hacéis siguiendo el vídeo en 25 30 minutos, vais a tener un platino. En este caso, al ser estaqueable y poderlo conseguir en Play 4 y en Play 5, pues en una hora vais a tener dos platinos de este World Simulator que no tiene ningún tipo de dificultad, pero sí puedes, que, puedes liarte un poquito buscando en alguna casa que no tengas que buscar y no es necesario. Hay muchas zonas que puedes pasar de largo sobre la marcha. Así que aquí os dejamos el vídeo y espero que disfrutéis. Y si os gusta, pues darle a like, compartir y suscribiros, como digo siempre, que es totalmente gratis y ayuda muchísimo al canal. Trust me, Kenny, we will find your runaway daughter soon. I know Lila, maybe even better than you. A 19-year-old girl couldn't have gone too far away. We both know there's a few residences around this area. We can check them out and ask whoever we see. It's been a while since you visited this neighborhood, but I come here more often. I'm familiar with the residents. Someone here must know something. We should search every settlement. You go ahead and I'll follow. been raining heavy for a couple of days, so there's some flood here and there. Check that place. I'll be waiting around here. Hey, grab the slider if you need to. That was odd. Let's move on to the next one. It's not too far away from here. We'll just go across the park area, and after that, watch out for the wild animals. A couple months ago, something bit my neck. 
They're just too damn quick. I couldn't even realize what kind of animal it was and the grass is teeming with them this season. When Lila was born, you were 20 and I was 16. I, I remember how happy Susie was to become a mother back then. We all are indebted to her for you becoming such a nice person after you met her. When you left home at 18 with no trace, I never thought I'd see you again. Who could have guessed a woman could convince you to come all the way from halfway across the country? When I saw you with her after that long, never ending year, I knew that you'd found the right one for you. Go see what's inside. I'm waiting here. Heard a lot of rumors while you're away from us, Kenny. Is it true that you were inside for three months? You were troublesome when you were younger, but if what they say about you is not bullshit, you're really lucky to have met Susie. I wish Lila were more like her and less like you at this age. <laughs> I, you know I talk to your daughter every day. She reminds me of her father's early ages. But there's one thing I can't take for granted. She is faithful. That much, I'm certain of. The only problem is that she ruined your birthday today. Sorry about that. <laughs> Take forever now. I'll be right here.
What a flood. It even caused avalanches. Now the tree trunks are blocking our way. We shall pass through that gate over there. I wish the town folk weren't such cowards, not lock them. Sometimes I feel like I'm digging into the past too much. What do you think? You know what they say, life is one day and it's today. When I carpe diem, it makes me feel recharged. You know, some people live in the future. In my belief, honestly, that is a sin, Kenny. All these people with life insurances, the ones who save up for the far future, I don't know. I just hope that I die before I get old. Maybe these words are gibberish to you, but believe me, Someday, you'll understand. Don't take too long. I'll wait for you around here. No stopping now. We should check out the chapel. Maybe the priest is there to explain to us what's going on. There's a bridge ahead. You know, the chapel is not too far away after we cross it. We should push just a little more. Maybe we can reveal some secrets there. Maybe the priest will explain it all to us. I know you're not much on the religious side, and I understand that, but their God is not exactly what I have in my heart either, but anyhow, this is not our concern at the moment. After all, Lila must be all that matters to you, right? We're almost there. 
Be honest, the chapel is not my favorite place in this terrain. But if we gotta go, we gotta go. And let's try to be nice to the priest while asking questions. He's connected, so he may know a thing or two. You search inside, I'm here. Well, shit happens. We shouldn't give up at this point. Let's keep on moving. I'm right behind you. These children, I envy them. They are pure and innocent. Being without their parents may be hard, but I can see the glow in their eyes. A glow so strong as if the shiniest star granted them freedom. Even if there's weird stuff going on, a part of me has peace. Seeing them as strong as they are, Watch out for the bushes. They are tall and have thorns. This path up until the four houses is somewhat narrow. A couple weeks ago, I hurt myself on the neck. Going all the way up is a little tiring, but when you reach the top, the scenery is totally worth it, especially when the sun sets and the bright starts begin to appear. Let's see what's over there. I'll wait here.
It's funny the way they think they know a lot about me. I know more about them. This miserable guy wasted his long ass life drinking. He never paid attention to his daughter's graces. No offense, but if he were still here and his daughter had vanished, it'd take him weeks, if not months, to realize. Anyway, the house at the hill, that's our last stop. If we don't find any answers there, I, I don't know what to say. Found what you were looking for? It seems that way. I wanted you to understand, though, this journey, and I waited for so long, Kenny. I never said I wanted to be God's disciple. I'll never be the one to blindly follow. Today, you've turned 40, and have seen and done some nasty things in your whole life. You're old and tired, and you should no longer taste that joy. What happens now is your choice. You either let us sacrifice your soul to Vega, or join Scions of Vega by first praying to him. Take your time making your decision. Yeah!